What's up guys? If you are sick and tired of getting scammed by NBA 2K's packs, make sure to head over to safembamt.com, use code BUGS for 5% off a checkout, and get that cheap, fast, reliable MT that you guys definitely need in this game. Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 Mind Team video. And guys, today we're going over market talk as per usual, man. Before we get into the video, guys, smash the like button, drop the sub, comment down below. You will qualify for 100k MT giveaway that we are doing on stream today. So if you guys even pull up to stream, you will have an even better chance of winning this giveaway. So 100k MT giveaway right on stream, guys. 100k! So make sure to hop on stream, either PS4, or Xbox, whatever you guys want. But yo, here we go, man. We're going to go over everything. We are going to go over the whole entire market, guys. And I know a lot of people have been asking me, bro, like, I, I listened to you and I lost MT. Well, here's the thing, man. I'm going to go over this secret, like, like literally the easiest way. Well, if you sell your cards and you lose MT, here's the thing. You most definitely bought these cards or cards in packs. That's what I want to talk about. And also, if you guys do need, do need MT, man, make sure to hit me up. I am selling MT and buying MT. So if you need to sell and or buy MT, hit me up on Instagram or Twitter. And um, here we go. So pretty much, if you are losing MT off the cards you are trying to resell, it's most definitely probably because they are in packs. Uh, so I've seen like about two comments within the last week about this. And they said, bro, I sold my cards and I lost MT. Well, think about this. If you're selling your cards and you're losing MT, with the market being this high, you got to be doing something wrong. The market is super high. I never lost MT from any cards being sold unless they're from the solo challenges or the XP challenges. So pretty much. If you bought a Westbrook at 80k on day one, he's like now 60k. So if you did sell him off, that's not my problem. It's bound to happen if you got him. You know what I'm saying? So pretty much, for when I say sell cards, guys, and you want to sell your Westbrook that's in packs, if you sell any cards that's in packs a couple days later, you're going to lose MT regardless. They might go up over time. They might not. Realistically, I'm usually talking about older cards, like maybe a three weeks ago or two weeks ago because their price is steady. So like if you buy cards from this week, you could snipe them out. That's a lot different. You could snipe them out. That is a lot different. But that's just one of the things I wanted to go over and how you're going to make MT and whatnot. So pretty much, man, the market's just literally just dead, guys. I've been trying to snipe for so long. Yo, Dominique for 130. That's kind of a snag right there. I should snag that. But um, guys, the market right now, man, it's just super dead, man. It's just no snipes. There's nothing. I've been grinding the market for a while, man. I've been trying to find some stuff, some little cheesies, but bro, there is literally nothing going on in the market. So if you're having trouble sniping, man, it's not just you. It's pretty much just everybody right now. It's just all over the place. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. It's just literally all over the place. So people keep asking me, man, Bugs, how the hell do I make MT, man? Right now, there is a couple ways you can make MT, but it's luck. It's sniping, bro. My best way to make MT. Like I said, if you make 15k an hour, man, at least, you pay two hours a day, you get 30k. 30k times 10 is 300k in 10 days, okay? 15k an hour isn't that hard. I want to focus on 15k an hour because 15k an hour adds up over time. It's not no 100k MT an hour. There will be videos that I will say 100k MT an hour, but <clears throat> if you want to make 15k an hour, guys, just hop on lower tier filters, man. Don't always go for the big ballers. Um, so for instance, lower tier, lower tier filters right here, man, amethyst guys, it's easier this way. If you just sit on an amethyst filter, you most likely will have a higher chance of getting snipes. This is how you're going to actually make MT and have a higher chance of making MT. It's this filter right here. You have a very high chance of actually making MT. So think about it with the small four pink diamond, since there is really no pack luck, there's no pack odds. There's no nothing going on. Really? Since there is like nothing going on within that. There's going to be less snipes. There's really nothing going on in the game right now. Really, right now, people are just trying to get next gen. You know what I'm saying? So right now, the market is all messed up. It's definitely dry. But tomorrow, tomorrow's Friday. So what's going to happen, guys? There's going to be a giant market crash, like per usual. Every time, guys, what happens on Friday? There's a big market crash. There could be a big market crash, I should say. So since there is 13 days left, the biggest market crash will happen. Not next Friday, the Friday after that. And why is that? Because season three will come. Tuesday, they're going to release Super Packs. The next day, or on Friday, then they're going to release the new season in which is around Thanksgiving, in which they're going to drop some crazy content, probably limited time content, that is going to be very scummy. So stay tuned for that. That is an incoming scam. 
but right now guys you should just try to snipe anything guys there's no methods there's literally right now guys the market is just dead it's all luck whatever i said in my top snipe filter video whatever i'm saying in this video is just facts man sniping is all luck whoever tells you you can make 100k per hour using this method or this and that and this and that it's not true bro those videos are clickbaits man unless i make a video on it then it's literal facts but if someone else makes a video on it most definitely they're just saying that to get you in a video and right now i'm probably naming this insane empty making methods because bro you gotta get somebody click on the video and and probably not even gonna be insane empty making methods probably just gonna go over the market but right now man small forwards pink diamonds this is probably gonna be your best filter we're gonna go over a couple other filters i think it's pink diamond southeast maybe uh i think pink diamond southeast is still good unless pete maravich is now a bid which i don't yeah so pink diamond southeast is still a very good filter we got tracy mcgrady dominique wilkins gilbert arenas john wall and that's it man those are two or four fire cards that you guys could get for snipe so here's another snipe filler that should help you make mt uh, another thing I've been noticing, guys, with badges, with some good badges. So I forgot what. Oh, it's deep three. So range extender on next gen is called deep threes. I don't know what's the point of changing it, but whatever. So deep threes, guys. I've been noticing a couple things. You could flip badges for like a decent amount of MT. Like you could get some badges for like let's say 20k and maybe flip them for like 25. So for instance, 17,900 for deep threes. You know what? I'm actually, if I sell that for 21,000, I might actually make some MT. So, like, there's like a bunch of little badges that you could actually sell and make some decent MT. Like, try flipping a little bit of badges. Like, I don't know, get a badge for 3K, sell it for 4K. It'll make you some MT. You have a chance of losing MT, but might as well just try it, you know? There's just a bunch of little methods. Another thing, guys, rubies. Like, if you're really struggling to make MT, just go with lower tier stuff, guys. Lower tier stuff. Um,. For instance, man, Kobe White's out, guys. So let's check over that Snipe filter. Here's another empty me method. I don't know why I always call... Oh, I don't even have my collection. But for instance, man, Kobe White, man, the GOAT, the GOAT. He's at like 10K. So guys, try sniping him out. There'll probably be a lot of snipes. There's probably gonna be a lot of competition in it. But if you snipe him out for, let's say, 7K, you're gonna make about 1,000 MT if you sell him for nine. So I don't know, man. It's definitely worth a try. I'm just trying to give you as many as many possible outcomes that you guys can possibly get but yo other than that man that's really all we got for the vid i'm just trying to go over as much possible things if you guys have any market talk questions tomorrow might be a market crash depending on what they drop we will see but yo we're 15k away a 15k away from xp from blake the stream is lit tomorrow hopefully the stream is lit again today and that's all we got for the vid man hope you guys enjoyed let me know if you have any questions anything bro we're here 50k away from xp from blake let's go have a good one peace What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to be up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.